Chief Meteorologist Patrick Corris Howard tonight for their game against East Hamilton. Hey, Patrick. Everything pretty good here at Howard. No problems weather-wise as East Hamilton has come to town. It's senior night at Howard, and you know what? You can't talk too long about Howard football before getting to Reggie White. The Howard alum was perhaps the very best player ever to come out of the Tennessee Valley. And tonight we take you back into the archives for Reggie White Day. You know, it was a Howard homecoming for the Hall of Famer. The man known as the Minister of Defense waves to the crowds from atop a black Mustang. The streets are lined with fans from all walks of life, and Reggie shakes hands with his oldest fans and his littlest fans. As the parade marches through, it's like a snapshot of Reggie's sports career, from Howard High School to the UT contingency. Even the cheeseheads made an appearance. But in Chattanooga, the parade ends where it all began for Reggie, Howard High School. As he walks into his alma mater, the ticker tape is flying, the crowd is deafening. Today's homecoming was in some ways a blast from the past for Reggie, as old teammates came to honor and reminisce. Everything you see on TV is what you see off the field. The guy is truly, uh, truly blessed, and I'm just happy to know him. He's truly a man of God. There was no way I could have missed this event. I had uh, uh, Sean Jones and Reggie and Keith Jackson and Keith Byers, and I had a bunch of guys playing that Super Bowl, and I was pulling for all of them, and it was great. Uh, I think the best team won the ball game, no question about it. Reggie had a super day. To a man who was without a doubt a great football player, but without a doubt he's even a greater person. This man is a servant first. <coughs> And now he's not just a great football player, he's not just a great athlete, he's a great leader of men and women, and he's one of the greatest role models in America today. If you drive over there today, you'll see that the road leading to that stadium is Reggie White Boulevard. We're very proud. And it brought tears to this six foot five football player's eyes. But before he leaves town, he leaves a thought with Chattanooga's children. Sitting in this band, and sitting in this audience, of future leaders. The question is, are you going to use your ability to lead, or are you going to allow your ability to use to be late? <laughs>